Hi there, um, it's Tyke from lovely Mobile Alabama here in the South. And uh, I'm going to just try a very simple swipe. You know, like this off right quick with black, blue, and do a gold swipe. So pardon me. Um, this is about, this is about, uh, you know, to be quite honest, I kind of eyeballed it, but I think it's about 50-50 on the gold for the swipe. And uh, I just filled up the cup halfway and then did the other half. So, and then uh, with the black, I have it a little bit more runny. So I put a little bit more Floetrol in it, probably like one to, th one to two. While this is 50-50, this is the one color to flow troll and the same with the blue and I think I'm gonna just do those so here we go I don't have any um, silicone in it yet so what I'm gonna do I'm not gonna put silicone in the gold well if I put put it in the gold I may gonna get some lacing but I'm not quite sure if I want to do that so I'm just gonna put about five drops in the black Two, three, four, five. That was probably six. This is a little bit my one. Two, three, four, five. And the silicone is the Tratma silicone that's been a very popular product to use. Uh, for the black, I use the Artist Love Black. And for the blue, I have the Morning Blue by Arnitas. And then the gold, again, is Artist Love Gold. So, um, so I'm going to. This is mixed already. This is what I'm gonna use for the swipe. It's uh, do the black. So I'm just gonna do very simple color. I did see a purple and a black, a plum and a black, and I wanted to do blue and black and see what's gonna happen there. So I'm gonna stir it up real good. I have my torch over there if I need it. Got some extra pillows, extra paper towels, and then a couple of the swipes. I don't have a big one that fits right over, but I can kind of go double over. Or what I could do, no, so I don't have big enough. But that's all okay. Again, that's all okay, and that's gonna be my punch knife. Anyway, so let's just do that. So it's gonna be, I just used up some of the cups I've used over the last couple of days. And uh, so this is going to be very dominating. I want some. Not necessarily dominating, but the black is supposed to come out really good. Put this on the corners. I'm gonna have some more. And then, um, hopefully I'm gonna have enough color, but I can mix something up real quick if I need to. And I have the morning blue. And um, traditionally, when you do this kind of a, you want it to be a little bit more liquidy. So I'm going to do like a tilt and then um, ooh, I need some more here. Yeah, I need some more, need some more blue I ran out of it, but I have it right here. So it should probably be good. And this was already in this bottle. I had it pre-mixed because I had about a half a bottle left and I added some of Floetrol. I do, do that a lot. When once the bottles and colors go down about halfway, I put Floetrol in it, about half of it, you know, so it's a one-on-one. -on -one. And then um, I can always add a little bit more Floetrol if I need it to be more liquidy. So, um, let me see here. Yeah, get, get a couple drops of um, 
silicone in there. Run two. That should be good. And I'm gonna just pour this over here in the gaps. Well, I'm hoping I have enough. I am kind of went a little bit on the meager side because this is um, an experiment and a trial. So, see what happens here. Just wanted to see what, uh, what it will do, just having a few colors in there. So, anyway, I'll do this. You can fill this in a little bit more with the black here, but I'm going to be tilting it anyway, so it's, I'm going to make it sure it's going to flow over to the sides. And the little cells are already forming once they're on top of one another. So, eh, it's a little bare, but that's okay. So I'm going to give it... Um, Little tilt so we can get this over. Just trying to get some of the color. Sometimes I do this just to give um, give a little bit more flowy option. They call it flow option, so it just helps it going in a certain direction. So because we want to get this off so I have it over on this side now I just need to tilt it a little bit over here right so as it is dripping like crazy you can hear the little it's like raindrops coming down okay so if it's still runny like this you want to make sure that you are getting the colors off. Let me tilt it over this way so I get at least my edges here. I don't know, can you see this? There's going to be more color coming. And then I'm going to do this. So there's a little bit of color I can put here on the edges already. There you go. Once it stops, running a lot that's when you know it is ready for swiping because i remember very distinctively being it being mentioned that you want to make sure that um the colors are not running too fast anymore because that will kind of mess with the swipe. So, okay, so we have blues. Ah, silver would actually be pretty good too, huh? So let me see really quick. So there's still a lot coming off. All right. All right, so I definitely had enough color. It's starting to be a little slower now. Here we go. Cute little cells already forming. Okay, so we get a little bit of my hands cleaned up because this can make make it very grayish too. So um, let's see. This over so. I Move this rack over a little bit. So and what I'm going to do is, wait, here we go. All right, in my trash, and then now I'm going to do the gold. And what I'm, I'm going to do some on the edge. And a little bit on the in the middle. So 
So it may be too thick though. I know. And then I have a little bit coming off here. So I have some color coming out here. Okay, let's see. So I have some gold left, which we can always use for another time, right? All right, so we get to swipe. Let's make sure we have contact. Oops. Just leave a little etch, push, and here we go. Let's keep it down. And once again, I keep forgetting my put foot down. When you lean over, so all right, here we go. Yeah, it's definitely different. Ooh, pretty. Look at that. Very pretty. Okay, I'm gonna wipe this off right on here. And then I wanna do I don't want to get this too muddy, so let's try and get it clean as much as possible. I'm going to use the other side here. There we go. Do this. Now it does have quite a bit of gold on there. Let's push it back just a little bit so I can get that paint over there. And now I'm just going to... There's a lot of gold in there. But, let's be patient, because we all know there's a gold streak coming through here, isn't it? Yep. Uh, let's see. Ooh, lots of gold coming over. Can do it's pretty just have the gold going off a little bit more here we go now I got this line in here so I don't know what's gonna happen there um, do I want to go over it See, now the gold is not going to flow as much because um, let me see if I can, am I going to do this? See, this is the line I am not as happy with, but that's okay. Um, let me see. I'm going to make a little cart using this. Let's use my little trusted little thingies. And um, you see, and a little bit more gold over here. And then I'm going to swipe it right over there in the area. Let me see, it's maybe a little thick though. But there's always something, right? Especially where the students are, so. But what I can do though, because this is a little bit bigger than I want this to be, and a little bit thicker, uh, go over it again. 
Let's start this time from the other side and go because I have some here, so I want to do it this way. Let me see, where is my gold spatula? Chip, chip, chip. Must have gone somewhere. Hmm. Okay, just a tiny little bit here again. Too much though, no? I think it is. Oh, yes. Sorry. I'm usually not that messy of a person, but especially not when it comes to showing things in public. Okay, let's see. Alright, smooth size. Let's do this again. I mean it's just kind of I have a little bit here on the side. Try this again. I mean, the cells on this came out really nicely, but that's okay. Here we go. It definitely needed to be sent out. There was no way I was gonna leave. have lifted that up beforehand, but you know, shoulda, woulda, coulda. Oh, it's a big old mess here. Okay, let's do this. But I can do. Now I can co cooperate that and cooperate this into my, here we go. A little bit more blue coming out now because I didn't I didn't do more black on that I think it'll be fine so they have blue there but the tendency of like you want to lift up left side or right side a little bit more and um See how this actually disappeared, this part? So it's all good. We are not crying over this stuff because it's gonna be all fine. It is a mess though. It is a super, super duper mess. So. Got a little bit of blue down there in the bottom, but oops, probably should. Oh, I destroyed the cells. I didn't want to. Oh man, Heiko, what were you doing? All right, all fine, all great. Marbly taste. Okay. There we go. So, I think what I'm going to do though, edges are a little bit bare. So, quiet here just trying to process things as they go by here 
trying to figure out what to do because it was really nice earlier. Now I'm like, uh -huh. hang on, I'm gonna put some other gloves on. I'm a mess. So, I think what I'm gonna do, no blues there. Okay, it's a cute little marble effect. Elevate it just a little bit. Just put some stuff under there. Just a little bit. And then what I'm going to do, I'm going to put. Where's my balloon? I'm going to put a balloon in there. Yay! I'm going to do a little bit of a. Well, they're not very prominent because I guess I have too much black color in there. But the flowers, hmm. which is fine too, I guess. Everything is just fine. You know, you just kind of, you can't cry over things that just don't work out. You just appreciate the things what, what they give to you. So this is actually a little bit more monochromatic here. which I think is actually very cute. I think everything I make is cute, even though it's, it's darn ugly. <laughs> so, let me see here. A little bit more tissue. Yeah, so it's actually almost a little bit um, really faint. I was kind of hoping there was some other color coming through, but um, since I didn't really have any gold, in it, how could that gold come through it, right? So that's fine too. So it's more like that grayish blue now. Should I do some more? I mean, you're not gonna really notice. So this is like very nude. Well, subtle, very subtle. Oh well, you know, you win some, lose some. So I have one here and there. Let's do one here. Okay. We'll put them here. It's pretty, the blue. And you know, since this is too runny, which I noticed already, it's probably all gonna just bleed into, into each other again. So it's all good. My favorite line, it's all good. There we go. So I guess that's it, peoples. Hmm, interesting. Not as exciting as I was hoping it to be. Now this little block over there, we could maybe make it like a corner. There we go. And then we'll, I got a corner already there, so there we go. So there's a subtle little pattern now in it, as in little petals. It's kind of cute there. Are you snoring, Jackie Bear? One of my big ones is with us. Here he is. So, as you can see here, there we go. So, there we go. All right, we're almost approaching the um, 25 minute mark. 
try to stay around that marker if I can. So anyway, okay guys, I guess that's it. I'm gonna probably try something different now. This is a little dark. So I was hoping for the color to pop a little bit more, um, like that blue coming out, but it's all good. All right, I'll see you later. Thanks for watching and have fun with colors. Bye-bye.